three hours, maybe? Yep. Two and a half? Yep. Okay. I'm sure all of you know who Justin Bieber is, and he has this following. <laughs> it's messy! They're these believers or whatever they are, okay? we got to come up with a nickname with you guys, because um, it was, it was, for myself anyway, one of the nicest afternoons that I've been lucky enough to spend um, with both his fans, himself, his family, um, and it again reminds me of maybe through all bad there's a little good. And when I got to, I got the privilege yesterday of watching the 300 or so of you um, get to sit with him and get to share stories and experiences. You know, you all got a couple of minutes with him, and I will share something with you that has always amazed me about David, which is, that's not a show yesterday. He, when he sits down, I just saw everybody shake their heads. When he sits down with you, there were a half a dozen of us begging him to go faster. So, you know, if you want to throw a stone, throw them at me and maybe some other folks, uh, but not him. He would have stayed there all night. And at one point, we asked him to hurry up. His response was, I got nowhere to go. Um, the restaurant was ready to close on the <laughs> were done. I left at three. Um, I understand you guys didn't leave till five. But I appreciate they didn't have to use the tear gas or anything else for you guys. Um, obviously the number one team, of course, is David Cook. I am done uh, sharing the accolades. Um, but I will say that as great and as energizing as David is, it's due to you guys that he's about to walk up here. So for the day, for, although David's coming up and we all adore him, also I want just a shout out to his team for their commitment and just their absolute love of uh, both him and supporting our cause. So thank you and obviously Mr. David Cook.